Hello everyone. Today's video is called Life is a Circus on Purpose. Now, when we think about life and everything that happens in the world and what we're going through, we sometimes feel it's not fair and we feel unlucky and we wonder why is this happening to me and this shouldn't have happened that way and it's just, it doesn't make sense. Why am I going through all this? But what you have to know is what I figured out that it is a circus on purpose. And if you have faith, you believe that everything happens for a reason. So you choose or you're put in the, any role of the circus. You could be the, the clown and you laugh at yourself and you don't take anything seriously. Life is a joke, carefree, no responsibilities. You could be on the high wire, the walking the rope, and you take risky chances, but you have that safety net underneath and you try to keep your balance. You could be the juggler, and this is women, single moms usually, students, parents, caretakers, workers, everyone trying to keep balance of their life. You could be the trapeze and you reach for the stars way up high, but you have your safety net at the bottom. You could be a magician and you make all your problems disappear and which means you might be hiding the truth and you're lying and you pretend you have a perfect life. You could be in the lion cage and this could be your workplace, your family or school bullies. But I believe that God is the ringleader of all. That's his position, and he is the manager in charge of all the acts. So I wonder then, I think, why is life a circus? Because it's through these experiences that you find out your true identity. If we work different jobs, we find out our true talents. If we study different subjects, we find out our true interests. If we have different hobbies, we find out our true passions. If we date all these different people, we find out our true compatibility. If we have different responsibilities, we find out our true skills. If we don't take chances and try different things, you'll never know what you're capable of doing and you have hidden talents. And when you have a negative experience, it definitely shows you what you don't like, and therefore you avoid those situations. So when you have a positive experience, it definitely shows you what you do like. So therefore you give your attention to that and you focus all your energy on that. And hopefully your inner sense of uh, well-being and your sense of self, it starts to grow, and then your character is shaped. So that's what I take from it. That's what I've figured out. So I hope you feel the same way, and I hope it helped you understand life. So take care. God bless. Have faith. Peace. Bye-bye.